What's going on guys and welcome back to another episode of Ark the Center. Last we left off, we tamed ourselves the Maelania, this guy right here. This giant spiky turtle thing. And honestly, he does look really cool, if I'm going to be honest with you. He looks really cool. He looks like a beefier version of the Carbonemis. We got a female, so we'll need a male if we want to, you know, breed them at some point. If we do. Now, I've done a lot more off-camera work. Now, you might be noticing, why is there a staircase over here? Well, let me show you. I've given the breeding area a second floor. And this is where our Dinosuchuses will be breeding. We got the perfect male and the perfect female. Once more come in, I will um, do something. And then we've got more space for other creatures to basically breed and whatever. I've got all this space here. So we can use that whenever we want to. Alright. But on today's agenda, we've got two things to do. First things first. I want to go out and tame that male spider that's over by my old base. Now, in order to do that, we need the female first. So, let me go grab the female. Let me go grab Candy Cane. Candy Cane was a max level female. And this male is only a 130. So, it shouldn't be too crazy. I mean, hopefully it has better stats. I'd like to breed them at some point. But yeah, we're going to take the spider with us. And we need some ghillie armor, and I think we do need the shield and the bug mashed insects as well. And then on the second agenda, I would like to see if we can find ourselves an owl griffin. Because I'd love to tame one of those. I heard with, like, the griffin, you know, back from the Ark days, they're one of the few flyers that you can shoot off the back of. Hopefully the owl griffin is no different. So, we'll have that. We got the darts that are about to spoil soon. We got this Dinosuchus. I think that's the male that we initially tamed. Yeah, so let me just put you away. Just so we have you. We've got the perfect male and the perfect female, so we don't need you. Alright. Now let me go get my ghillie armor, because we are going to need that for the, for the tame. Well, the spider tame, anyway. And then I think we need the mashed insects. Yeah, because I don't think they take kibble. Do they take kibble? Well, I've got the mashed insects just in case they don't take kibble. Alright, so Mufasa, wherever you are, I think you're under the stairs. Yep, you are. Alright, let's go. We've got the kibble. Do we have the kibble, right? Yeah, we do. We got 13 kibble. That should be good enough. And I think the Owl Griffin will probably tame with just the one. I just need... There we are. Because the RG has really been the only flyer we've had ever since we had to get rid of the d -arc Because, you know, the game kept crashing in the whole bit. But we got that. I mean, we could use the Dinosuchus. Oh, but we need like a... No, we don't. We don't need a flyer to um, get there. So, you know what, RG? Take a break. I will come back for you when we're ready to tame the Owl Griffin. You got about 53 levels, so let's put that up to 100,000, maybe 2,000 weight, and then 2,000 stamina, and then just put the rest in the melee. All right, once we get to the water, that's where you'll come in. So let's ride Mufasa, and let's head over to, what is it, the, my old base. Alright, the game's probably gonna freeze because I'm passing here. Let's expect that. Yep, there it is. There's always that spike with this. And there's another Maelania. Level of you. A 50. You know what? Let me kill you to make room for a higher level. Just to make room for a higher level. Alright. Ouch. I think a Dillo just attacked me while I was attacking a Dodo. I think that's what happened there. Alright. We need to get to the... The island where I... My old base was. Hello, what are you? That's a 180 Glacus. Um, okay. Should we tame that next episode, maybe? 
I heard with these guys, what you got to do is kill some jellyfish and then feed it like 10 jellyfish, and then it will challenge you to a fight. And then basically you got to beat it, and then it will basically lay an egg for you. Hmm. That would have really come in handy. A hollow tiger. You're probably going to be a nuisance. There we go. That was a max level. Damn. Uh, we could have tamed that, actually. All right, Mufasa, switch over to the shoulder, and then let's head over to the Dinosuchus. All right. That's good to know that you're here. Yeah, there's jellyfish around. Yeah, we'll, we'll probably use, like, the Nothosaurus or something. Or maybe something along the lines of, uh... Hmm. What else, what else can I use that's, like, immune to jellyfish stings? I mean, I could use the Nothosaurus to kill the jellyfish, and then use the croc to fight this guy. Yeah, that could work, actually. That could work. All right. So, yeah, you gotta fight it to have it lay an egg. That's what you gotta do. All right. I just found that by accident. So, yeah, 180, that'll probably be good. A little 147 carbon enemies. That's a 145, I think. Yep. All right. We're good to go. You can go away. Alright, let's go find that spider. Actually, I should probably change into the ghillie armor first. Oh, are you... You are a Maraxes. They spawn around here, too. That's good to know. You know, just in case we can get a stronger one... If we can get a higher level... I think it was a female that we need... I think it's a female. As soon as we get, like, a high-level female, then we could probably tame that. <sighs> I love this game sometimes. Come on, get up there. I know you want to get up there. Mufasa, get up there. Thank you. It's not like Scar's there to throw you off the cliff. You can get up there. That's our guy. That's our guy. All right. Now, this is where our female spider comes in. This is where Candy Cane comes in. And we are over-encumbered. Wonderful. I think it's... Yeah, it's C to release the pheromone. Alright. And then you give it this guy. And then you give it this. And there we have it. Male spider has been tamed. Good job. Alright, let's switch back to Mufasa. And then we'll... Check its stats when we're done. So, well, what I might do is uh, bring the spiders back to base. And then I'll go ahead and... Well, first let's kill this quick alpha raptor. That'd be great. And then we'll probably come back here and... Uh... Alright, let's see if we've got better loot. Let's see if we've got better loot. Right after we kill these raptors, apparently. All right. I don't think we got any loot from that. Hello, Therizino, level 55. I believe I did lose our Therizino when the crash happened. That was an Arcology Therizino. So, and I don't have that mod on there anymore. Which kind of sucks. Okay, let me go back, bring the RG. Go get the RG, and then we'll go from there. So let me just... Uh, See what you have in your inventory. I'll take this the shield, the cooked. No wait, hold on. What am I doing? I could just do this. I keep forgetting I could just do that. Alright, let me go get the the Dinosuchus ready. Alright, let's go ahead and go into holiday. I wanna get a pair of glasses. And we need more prime to get the dinosaur thing. A steak knife. Hmm. Alright. All right, I think we should be good to go. Let me put the rest of this cooked meat in the fridge for now. Glasses. How does that look? Ah, looking snazzy. Looking snazzy. All right. We got that. All right, so now this is where the RG comes in. All right, well, actually, let's look at the spider stats first. So the female we had had 35 into health, 48 into stamina, 33 into oxygen, 48 into food, 32 into weight, and 27 into melee. The male has 36 into health, 
so that's better. 31 into stamina, not as good. 34 into oxygen, 30 into food, like no one cares. 25 into weight, so not as good with weight, terrible weight. And 37 melee, it does have better melee. So you know what, I might breed these at some point. So let me just put the spiders away. So that's candy cane. And let's get our male spider out. All right, so this is the male spider that we got. Pretty cool. All right, let's go ahead and maybe put some more stuff away, if we can. All right. Now that that's all taken care of, let's take the RG out and look for an owl griffin. Yeah, I know we've got some roofs that are a little bit off. I'll, I'll fix that on my own time. All right, not the saurus. All right. So I have seen our first owl griffin by my old neighborhood. So we're going to visit my old neighborhood first and see if there's one there. And then if not, I'll look in the volcano island, see if there's any there. And then we'll, and then I'll guess we'll see what else happens. I, I guess they could spawn in the jungles as well. I'll look in the jungles on the way. Now with the owl griffin, I'm accepting no lower than a 130. A max level would be great, but 130 is the lowest I'll go. All right, I didn't see any in the volcano island, so I guess we'll look in like the jungles and whatever, see if we can find anything there. I mean, I'll take a Majungasaurus if we can find one, or that Sukumimus thing, because those are traditional knockout tames as well, to my knowledge. The mod developer might change those at some point. Maybe explore the jungle a little bit, see if we can find one in the jungle. Hello, Melania. That's a 145 female or male Melania. I think the one we have is a female, if I'm not mistaken. Let me just go ahead and like knock out this uh, this male Melania real quick. I'll let you tame up, and then 28 into health. 16 into melee. Your melee doesn't seem that great, if I'm gonna be honest. Alright, down you go. Awesome. Are right, you require two kibble? I'm gonna put two kibble in you. Three. Just in case. Alright, now that that's done, I'm gonna let you tame up. And then we're just gonna go ahead and Try and find this owl griffin if we can. Okay, so we are near the iceberg. I haven't come across a single owl griffin just yet. I just saved the game just in case if we go near the iceberg, the game crashes. Just in case the game crashes, I just saved right over here. So we're going to see if we can explore over here if we can. If the game will let us without crashing. And right away, I see a bunch of penguins. This is cool. I do need to get an organic polymer farm going. That's a 140 male. I'm pretty sure the one we need is a female. 22 points in health. Mm, 27. Uh, the melee doesn't seem too bad, though. What are these? Ambulocetus. 55, a 140, and a 90. There's another Spino here, an 85 male. Okay, obviously we won't tame these today, but they're there if we want them. Luckily, I'm able to explore this place without the game crashing. There's a couple more. There's a 50 and a 90. Oh, there's actually quite a few of them here. The male Ania tamed up, which is good. All right. No, I'm not seeing anything worthwhile. Except for that 140 Ambulocetus. We'll go after it. Don't worry. Alright, let me continue my search for an Owl Griffin. And if not, this might be considered an L. I don't like ending videos with L's. I kind of like W's. I prefer my W's over my L's any day. So I'll keep searching for an Owl Griffin. Oh, hello. 130. You know what? That's good enough. Alright. You will attack creatures, so yeah, that's the only problem with you. Alright, so let me go ahead and put you away. 
switch over to the switch over to Mufasa. All right, Seagull, get out of here. Do me a favor, get out of here. There we go. All right. Is that Protoceratops dead? And down he goes. Awesome. Four minutes till he's awake. Okay, good to know. Let me just eat this Protoceratops real quick. Make sure there's nothing in the area that could possibly kill it. Alright. Let's uh, tame this bad boy. How much kibble do you need? Just the one. Alright, cool. Um, Let me put some kibble on top of you. And I will let you guys know when this uh, owl griffin is fully tamed. So I'll see you guys in a little bit. And there we have it. That took a long time, but the owl griffin has been tamed. All right, that took a long time. All right, let's head back to base. You can switch over to the shoulder pet now. We'll head back to base and uh, we'll see what, you know, what this guy is capable of. It was so hard to find the damn thing. It really was. But I will see you guys back at base. Once we tested this guy out, we'll end the episode off by hatching some more dinosaurs. I should probably do some off-camera breeding. And we're back. We're officially back at beautiful base. Alright. We got a female for you, Maelania. Or a male, sorry. We got a male for you. Alright, let's compare the two stats of the Maelanias. So this was the female that we tamed before. 36 points into health, 34 into stamina, oxygen food, no one cares. 32 into weight, and 30 into melee. And then the male had 42 points into health, so already better. 33 into stamina, not as good. Oxygen, food, no one cares. 32 into weight, and 30 into melee. Okay, so I had the same exact weight and the same exact melee. Though the female had more stamina and the male had more health. All right, so we got the male and the female Maelania, so we'll breed them up at some point. As for this guy, 30 into health, 35 into stamina, oxygen, food, no one cares, 34 into weight, and 37 into melee. All right, you can stay there for a bit. And now the Owl Griffin. What are your stats? 34 points into health, 38 into melee, or sorry, stamina, oxygen, food, no one cares, 24 into weight, that's kind of terrible, and 34 into movement, into uh, melee. Okay, so other than the weight, not bad. Of course, we could have gotten a lot better, but it is what it is. Oh, and I don't need a saddle to ride you. Interesting. Can I shoot off the back of you? I can. Awesome. All right. Precious, what are you doing all the way over there? Something attacked the base again. You know, I need to expand the sea base. That's what I need to do. All right, let's officially test out our owl griffin. The fact we don't need a saddle to ride this guy, but I'm sure the saddle will provide more protection. Wait. Since you're a griffin, can you... Oh, you sure can. You sure can dive. All right, let's see what kind of damage we do. Pegos, really? 130 with the left click. Okay, we landed. We can pick stuff up with the right click. You stole something from me. Give me back whatever you stole. What'd you steal? Some fiber. Of course you stole some fiber. Alright. Do we have any more tags? C? Oh, C does like a hoot. That is so cool. Does control? I think control does like a shriek. Huh. That's cool. That's honestly really cool. Yeah, this will definitely be our new... Our new... Um, travel mount. Alright, you stay there. I'm just gonna go put some stuff away and then we'll hatch some more eggs. 
see if we can get like either a triple health mutation on the Rex or like more mutations. Alright, let me just uh, drop. Actually, no, the chitin could come in handy, actually. Chitin, we put away. Wood, drop. Everything. Just drop a lot of this stuff. Alright, so for the Rexes, we need a 246. And for the Vectospinuses, a 213. That's what we need. So we'll go ahead and uh, wait for those to hatch up, and then we'll officially end the episode. Alright, Vectospinus. Let's hatch up all 30 of those. We need a 213 for these guys. Or a 215. Alright, so 213. No, how about 215? Nope, no mutations from any of those. Let's go ahead and kill those. And then Rex. We need a 246, at least. Alright, so 246. Are oh, we got a 246? We got a triple health mutation. Triple health. Let's go. Better than nothing. What about 248? Nope. Alright. We got a triple health mutation. So let's go ahead and, uh, I guess delete all of those. Double health mutation. There's the single health. There's the double health. And we got a triple health mutation. Let's go. We got way luckier with that than we did with the other one. So I'll let that grow up. Let's see if we got any more eggs. Alright. Let's hatch up these last few eggs. We did get a 246 Rex. We'll have to see what that was. Triple health. And then we got a stamina. We got one that's a stamina and one that's a triple health. I'll keep the triple health. Kill that one. Let's see. 213. We don't have a 213 for the Vectospinus. Alright, so we got our triple health mutation Rex. We didn't get anything from the Vectospinus, but you know what? That's fine. And with that, that's going to have to wrap it up for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more. It would really help out a ton. But until next time, I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching.